So here we are told that we have um, A, B, C, D, which is a parallelogram. Now, parallelogram with the points A, B, C, and D. And then C, we are not told which one is C here. We're supposed to come and get C. In fact, if you look at the question that I'm looking at here, it says determine what are going to be the coordinates of C. Now, since this thing here is a parallelogram, it means we need to know some of the properties of a parallelogram. But the most common one that we use if we want to get the coordinates of C is the fact that if I draw a line from B to D, and then I draw a line from A to C, this here, the diagonals are going to bisect each other. So I'm going to calculate the midpoint here, DP first. So I will say I have B, which has coordinates of five, and five. And then I have D, which has coordinate of seven and two. And then from here onwards, I will use the midpoint formula. By now we know the midpoint formula. Midpoint formula says which you have X at the midpoint, which is going to be given by X1 again, okay? plus X2 All over two. divided by two. And then it says Y at the midpoint is going to be equal to Y1 plus Y2 divided by what by two. Okay, now we can choose alphabetically. This one is going to be X1 again. Okay? This one here is going to be Y1. This one is going to be X2. This one is going to be actually Y2. Okay, we are looking for X in the midpoint. Our X in the midpoint is going to be given as X1 is fine plus X2 is seven plus seven divided by two. And then it says which our X in the midpoint is going to be given as six. six. Okay, let's do this one, Yaga Y. The one of Y, it says Y1 is five ne? plus Y2 is two. Ne? All over two. All over two. And then it gives us what? Seven all over two. So it says Y of the midpoint is going to be equal to seven all over two. Then we can say the coordinate of the midpoint M. We can call this one M since they didn't say anything about it. So if you call it M, it says which M is going to be equal to six is to what is two? It's to seven all over two. <laughs> okay, next, we want C. Ne? When we want C, then we'll come and say, okay, we already update our diagram. Let's update our diagram. When we update our diagram, we'll come and say, we know what are the coordinates of M. The coordinates of M are going to be given as six is two. Seven is two. Then we're looking for C. Now, if we take line AC, so we're going to take A, and then we're going to take C. Coordinates of A is one is to two. Coordinates of C is X is to Y. We don't know them, okay? And then we have coordinates of the midpoint. So we'll say X at the midpoint, First, X1 plus X2. All over two. All over two. And then we have Y of the midpoint, to which is going to be y1 plus y2 divided by y by 2. Okay, now we know what is x at the midpoint. Kevin, what is one at, y is x at the midpoint? It's, it's what? So x at the midpoint is 6, which is going to be equal to... Now, if we do this alphabetically, this one is going to be x1, this one is going to be x2, this one is going to be y1, this one is y2. Okay, X1, what is going to be our X1? One. One plus, what is our X2? X. X divided by two. And then if we solve this one, we cross multiply again. Oh, we multiply both sides by two. It says two multiplied by six, it gives us what? Oh. And then it says one plus X. X equals 11. Take one to this other side, it says X is going to be equal to what? Two? 11. The and then we'll come and say here, we have 11 here. Yeah. Okay, let's look for this one. What is y at the midpoint, my pen? Y of the midpoint. Yes. Is there say y in the middle? Y in the middle. What is y in the middle? Yes. So we have seven all over two, which is going to be equal to what is y one? It's two. Y1 is two plus one. What is Y2? It's Y divided by two. Ne? So we multiply by two, we multiply by two. It says seven 
is going to be equal to 2 plus y. y. Take 2 to the other side, it says which y is going to be equal to what you find. So the coordinates of C, as you can see here, we have 11 and then and what and That will be it for today. Mark allocation. Mark allocation. Mark allocation. Mark allocation. Mark allocation. Mark allocation. 